First on five, the man accused of firing at people, killing one person during Mobile's New Year's Eve festivities is going to prison on federal gun charges. WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones joins us in the studio. Jeremy, these federal gun charges come from a gun that police say is the gun that he used to kill a person and injure others. Uh, during uh, right before the moon pie event this past New Year's Eve. That's exactly right, Pete and Devin. Federal prosecutors argue that Thomas Earl Thomas Jr. modified his handgun illegally by putting in a Glock switch, which turns a gun into a fully automatic weapon. Thomas was sentenced to 10 years for illegal possession of a machine gun. He's accused of opening fire on Dolphin Street on New Year's Eve, killing 24 year old Jatoris Reeves and injuring eight others ranging from ages 17 to 57. Now, even though Thomas was sentenced on a federal charge, he still faces a murder and assault charges in Alabama. The case has been turned over to a grand jury. Reporting in the studio tonight, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.